Hi everybody. So my name is Jay Sims and I am a junior at Omaha Central. Alright. And sorry. This poem is titled When Our Worlds Collided. The rainfall landed upon my cheeks and I could not decipher whether it was the salty secretion from my eye glands or salt water from the ocean. And I did not care. Beads of moisture spilled the words that my heart could not express and a whimper escaped my pale lips as my internal being began to combust. She was alluring and angelic, magical and mystical, elegant and enticing, and she was all I wanted. Her ears creased as the dry gale displaced its common winds near her. Her caramel-colored loose curls danced in the powerful gusts that were seen to trample even the mightiest gods. And the way her chocolate lab eyes that resembled fine cocoa powder and the ripest acorns captivated my entity was unheard of and I did not care. She burned as though she was a condescent bulb trapped in a cubicle crowded with mirrors. And I was sightless from the flame, a flare so unruly that bystanders were singed within 10 feet of her. The fire that burned could not be extinguished with observers' efforts, and I did not care. She was so close, yet, so far that the blaze ignited and defeated me in a cycle of hope and betrayal. We were almost, but almost is never enough. She enkindled my embodiment until I finally discerned the third degree incinerations on my forearms and wrists. I thought the rain would heal the wounds, but it only made it sting worse. And I barely cared. There is no happy ending in which the hearts of the villain and hero entwine. I still wonder which part she played in mine. Thank you.